I think anybody who has any records or any CDs has one album that Simon has played on. I said to him, oh, you know, I want to do some drums. I'm going to bring this guy, Simon Phillips, in. And I was going, Simon Phillips, oh my god. He took over from Keith Moon for The Who. I mean, that's an impossible job. I know we met on sessions in London, and um, he was just a legend. So I, pr I probably didn't even speak to him because I would be so shy. But he played on The Lion King for me, all sorts of things. It's been a long time since I've done a film date, especially one like this where they're kind of cues. How did that feel? I don't know how long it's been since I've counted bar 202. <laughs> <laughs> I do it all the time. It's just so alien to rock and roll or, or jazz or playing in a song form. So on, always, you know, and there's nothing that daunts him. And at the same time, there's a fire and there's a ferocity in his playing. He'll go right to the edge of where it becomes dangerous. That's what I like. I like people who, who push things out just a little too far. <laughs> 